the harvester is the yet another tool that can be used to passively uh, and the uh, get the data from the publicly available uh, databases like Google, uh, Bing, uh, uh, Chinese databases, uh, Chinese uh, search engines, and many more. Let's explore the harvester and uh, try to see and figure out how many databases it have and what are the limitations, what are the features that it supports. So typing the harvester reveals every information that it requests in order to uh, uh, perform the passive data gathering and the intelligence gathering. So uh, at first we can see here is the data source uh, that it uh, uh, dig for the information and the email. Uh, about the search, a specific company, a specific person, and uh, a specific uh, uh, things. So here is the Google, Google CSE, Bing, Bing API, PGP, there is the Jigsaw, Twitter, Google Plus, and all. Uh, this is the switch that will use all those data sources uh, to uh, fetch and collect the data around the internet. So here are the options to start. Uh, start in result number x default is zero. So this is uh, okay with that. Verify host name via DNS resolution and search for virtual hosts. Save the results. So uh, this is for the report generation and for the output. And uh, for it it can also perform a DNS brute force for the domain name. Perform a DNS TLD expansion discovery use this DNS server so we can specify the DNS server and I'll limit the number of features to work with so here are the options so uh, at last this is the best thing that you can also uh, query for the uh, discovered hosts uh, in a Sudan that is the called uh, database for the hackers so let's start uh, using uh, these commands so basically the harvester is the command and D is for the domain name. So in this case, uh, let me use the hacking.org in order to find out uh, emails and what every details about the DNS. Then it will search in uh, Sudan. So uh, let's limit it to 50. It will be better to limit the results. But you can perform on your own. I will uh, set the database uh, source to all and uh, I will also use Sudan database to query discovered hosts and let's start Okay, uh, so as of now, uh, there are not uh, much information, uh, but uh, we have found uh, two email addresses, as you can clearly see, and there are no hosts. There are no any information about the hacking.org in the Sudan database. Hope this is doing the best. Let me do and perform this once again and uh, this is limitations let me do it for the hundred and to try once again okay uh, so once again uh, we can see there are more two more uh, email addresses are there so this is uh, sometimes it works uh, and uh, collects data um, uh, in the as uh, we already know that uh, this tool performs uh, passive uh, data collections and then data intelligence gathering to uh, obtain the data and uh, this is the reason why it uh, sometimes uh, search for more uh, databases search for more public databases and uh, then it uh, provides the results that's why it is something uh, different in all the way I run this tool uh, two times and the, their difference are there. Okay, so now let's start with uh, all, uh, I mean, uh, other domain like uh, okay, dot in. Let's see what are the uh, 
public databases results are there Uh, because of I have used the all switch so it will search in all the search engines it supports okay so there is nothing and no information so there let me try it once again you can see uh, it says full harvest great to see uh, there is nothing information about uh, my organizations and uh, that's good let's see uh, one another information about other third cup parties uh, like uh, some big companies apple.com if it have any information about uh, from the public databases Uh, whenever uh, I say public databases, it means Google databases, Bing databases, and the, all the search engines that store crawl all the sites around the world and store some data. That is called public databases. Okay, uh, nice to see it here that it have revealed uh, much email addresses. Uh, you can see. I think it will be uh, more than 100. Nice to see, uh, you can see this is also the email address. And, uh, okay, appleseed.apple.com. So now, uh, as you can see, host found in the search engines and uh, resolving host names to the IP addresses. You can clearly see. Uh, it have also resolved the IP addresses to its host name and uh, this is euro.apple.com, group.apple.com and similarly. So it have also found the virtual hosts like uh, this you can see this is the iTunes IP address. Sudan database search is also there. It also searched for the Sudan search engine for hackers and found the results. So here you can see this is the Sudan empty reply or error in the call. There are multiple options that could be used uh, to uh, categorize the data that we it will provide to you and present to you. You can use multiple switches, multiple uh, things to customize it according to what you need. So uh, just try it uh, using different companies and uh, use uh, approx all the switches that is uh, that may be uh, useful for you if you are going to use the and uh, hunt for the public available information that is uh, really juicy information and there is nothing uh, illegal in that thank you